You might have been hearing about sugar substitutes like stevia and wondering if they're safe. Well, there are a lot of non-nutritive or calorie-free sugar substitutes like NutraSweet or Equal or Splenda, and then there's stevia. They all have a similar effect on the body that you need to be aware of, and that is that they taste sweet even though they don't have any added calories to them. Now what happens when your tongue tastes sweet, it instantly sends a message to your brain and to your body to start producing insulin because your body's expecting carbohydrates to follow that sweet flavor. So when your body starts producing more insulin and there's no sugar for it to shuttle around and get rid of from the blood system, that can lead to insulin resistance over time. And people who are using sugar substitutes to lose weight actually find that they're having a hard time with it or even gaining weight over time. So all of those sugar substitutes can have the opposite effect of what we use them for, which is to try to lose weight. Now stevia may be safer to use than all of the other man-made, processed, non-nutritive sweeteners. Why is that? You can actually get stevia in its most natural form, which is a leaf. You can grow stevia very easily as a plant in your house, in your backyard. You can use those leaves, add them to tea, add them to beverages to naturally sweeten your beverages. That is not going to cause any health problems that have been related to things like NutraSweet, like saccharin. There aren't those studies showing that it's associated with cancers, with headaches, with anxiety, like those non-nutritive sweeteners. So using stevia in its natural state might be the best option for you.